We about to get the skin on point. Mm -hmm. welcome back to my channel thanks so much for tuning back in for yet another video in today's video I won't be talking about hair which is surprising <laughs> but I will be talking about my skincare my skincare routine hopefully my new skincare routine so for those who don't know me I have always battled with acne most of my life um, teenage up until adult years currently um, I have not really been battling with acne as bad until here recently and I just feel like it's getting worse and I just definitely need to do something, change something with my skincare um, products I may be using. My breakouts tend to be along my jawline uh, for the most part and kind of under my neck a little bit. I think for the most part is due to just a lot of oils in my hair and my scalp just sinking into my face, into my skin because of the hair products that I'm using and it's just you know breaking me out so again i just had to do something to fix this to try to get my skin back on track so i don't have to really keep putting makeup on my skin to cover up my blemishes and flaws because i really don't like wearing makeup like that especially in the hot summer months so i have been following urban skin rx for a very long time but i've never purchased anything from them until just the other day they had a 25 percent uh sale on all of their acne products and I had to get something. I had to get something. And the one thing that I've always wanted to try is their pumpkin uh, mask. I literally just got this today. I checked my email and it said delivered. It was in my mailbox. So I have not opened it up. I have not cracked the seal. So we're going to open it up together. And I'm going to show you my initial reaction. And just to demo it and, and see how I like it. And then over time, I'll do a follow-up video after using it for a little while. And just share with you my final thoughts about this product. And this is not sponsored. I did purchase this product with my own money, so I just want to put that out there, just that disclaimer. So this is the box, and on the front it says Urban Skin RX. So the box is really pretty, nice uh, teal blue color, which I love this this color. And let's see what is inside. So what do we have here? We got a lot going on in the box. So when you first open the box, it says Let's Get Glowing. Save 15% on your next order with code get glowing. So we'll be using that. This paper inside looks like honeycombs. So cute. So it also has the confirmation of what I ordered. So the last thing is just the product inside of the box. And it shows at the very bottom of the box all of their social media platforms. So the item I purchased is their purifying two-on-one pumpkin pour detox mask and scrub. This is in a 2.5 ounce tube. And you can also see some of their highlighted ingredients on here, which is their kaolin. This defoliates dead skin cells and pulls out the impurities, toxins, and dirt from the pores. It also has bromelain, which reduces inflammation in the skin and promotes healing from skin injuries and acne scars. And salicylic acid, which gently effoliates oily, acne-prone skin and removes makeup, excess oils, encourages the shedding of dead skin cells to keep skin clear and prevent breakouts. So the product claims this is a self-warming dual action mask and scrub that combines detoxifying clay, exfoliating jojoba beads, as well as enzymes and vitamins to reduce the appearance of pore size, deep cleanse, and rejuvenate the skin. It also shows who should use this purifying pumpkin pore detox mask and scrub, and that's anyone with breakout prone skin, clogged pores, large pores, uneven skin tone, rough texture, aging skin, and dull skin. So it says this product is supposed to smooth, clarify, and improve the appearance of your pore size. And I do have large pores. I can see them a mile away sometimes, or like big craters, which is gross. After studying the ingredients, unless it's under a different name for pumpkin, um, I just assumed that there would be some type of pumpkin um, extracts in here, pumpkin something ingredient in here but i'm not seeing anything on here that says anything about pumpkin as an ingredient unless it's under another scientific name for pumpkin that i don't know <laughs> hopefully it smells like pumpkin so let me see what this smells like and sealed up oh it's got little orange beads in there it smells like pumpkin it actually smells like those pumpkin spice candles that they usually put out during the fall that smells really good. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. I'm just gonna show you what I'll be using to cleanse my skin before using this mask 
and then I'll show you my follow-up moisturizer for my skin. So the first product I'll be using is from Purpose. This is a gentle cleansing wash. So I got this at Walmart and it's one that I would recommend if you do have sensitive skin and you want to really get the impurities and dirt out of your skin. Uh, a good face wash this is one i would definitely recommend after i use this pumpkin mask and scrub i'll then follow it up with a really great moisturizer so from garnier skin active i'll be using their new smoothing facial mist and also from garnier skin active i'll be using their moisture rescue this is a refreshing gel cream for dry skin and as you can see i'm almost out so i'm gonna have to re-up on this product so i'm gonna go ahead and douse my face with some warm water just to get this process started going in with the face wash i'm going to kind of speed that up because it's just face washing but i'm going to slow it down when i get to the purifying um, mask and scrub because i want y'all to hear my thoughts and opinions about my initial reaction about this product and how it feels and all the good stuff Massage the product in for approximately 30 seconds and leave on for up to 15 minutes. And it is pretty warm already in my hands. So I'm kind of working it between my fingers and I kind of feel the warming sensation. So we're going to go ahead and apply. Ooh, it's even warmer when you put it on your skin. Mm. Okay now. It smells good. Feels good going on. Work it down for about 30 seconds. Definitely want to get my problem prone areas, which are right on the jawline there. And a little bit under the jawline. Those. I can feel the little beads that kind of giving a little exfoliating feeling. One of the beads is, seems a little, a little big. This is a pretty big bead. <laughs> like a rock. Yeah, it feels good. Nice exfoliation, very gentle exfoliation. Not rough, not harsh. So I like that. And the warming sensation didn't last long, just a few seconds really. Wasn't even 10 seconds, I would say, that the warming sensation lasted once I started working. So it did dissipate, and I think it did say that on the product somewhere that the warming station will start to dissipate as you're working it on your skin. So it says to leave on for up to 15 minutes. I'm gonna see how well my skin likes this product. So I'm gonna try to leave it on for up to 15 minutes. Hopefully I don't experience any irritations or any type of itchiness or burning sensation. I don't think I will, but I'm gonna leave it on uh, for up to 15 like it said. So I'll be right back. So I'll say this, my skin feels really, really smooth. I mean, extremely smooth. It feels so good and so soft. Now I'm not expecting to see a drastic difference this quickly, but my pores looks like they have shrunken a little bit. The clarity of my skin looks so refreshed and it just looks so smooth. It just looks really good, you know, aside from the dark marks on my face. Just the quality of my skin right now looks so much better than it did previously before I applied this product. And that's no lie, that's no joke. Nobody paid me to say anything. This is just what I'm seeing on my skin right now. And yeah, it looks really, really good. And it doesn't feel dried out either. It really doesn't. But I'm still gonna follow this up with uh, my moisturizer. So let me go ahead and do that. Then I'm just going to go in with a little bit of the gel cream because a little of this does go a long way. So I'm just going to apply a little here and there. Make sure I get all dry areas of my skin, especially my nose. My nose dries out really fast. I think I use a little bit more than what I needed. A little bit of this product does go a long way. So next time I'll just use a little bit 
instead of the amount that I did, which that was unnecessary, but I am heavy handed, but um, I will be making this product last me um, at least a month. So I definitely hope that I get all of the things that this product claims that it will do for your skin. And I'm hoping that it also helps with some of the dark marks on my skin as well. I'm hoping I see um, that start to minimize. It doesn't really say anything about uh, dark marks specifically on here, but I'm just hoping that I do start to see a reduction in that as well. But yeah, I'm really excited that I finally got a chance to get my hands on this product. I think I'm gonna really like it. So again, I will give you guys a follow-up couple weeks from now and just let you know what my final thoughts are and how my skin is looking and doing at that time. So if you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up because it does help my channel. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to comment. Check out my Amazon store. The link is in the description box below. Again, it's Just Janine and I will see you on the next video. Bye guys.